Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Monday the 25th of September 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Um, I shall be playing the New York Times hard level Sudoku Puzzle in just a moment. A quick reminder, this channel does not promise notation free puzzle, does not promise a beautiful or elegant solution, but I will get you to the end and that's all I can say um, at the moment. Um, what's going on there's an article in the guardian penned by gordon brown former prime minister of the uk and it mentions uh, I, I suggest you read it i'm not going to um, say the whole plan because it, i don't want to misrepresent him but it involves taxation of petro states but an interesting fact that i noticed was that last year the uh, um, oil and gas companies banked four trillion oh i think it was dollars i forgot if it was dollars or pounds four trillion dollars i think it was uh, which is larger than the entire uk economy and also uh, around 20 times the combined amount of all aid offered across the world so it kind of puts it into perspective about just how much money these companies are really making and i suppose why they'll continue to do it if we don't stop them Right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? Um, I have no idea where to begin. I don't haven't seen anything uh, doable yet, so I will just... I don't like that word, doable. And that was not a word when I was a kid. Uh, the word possible was the correct word to use. Somehow or another, the word doable seems to have arrived in the dictionary. I don't like it much. Um... Oh, I see five and six blocking down here like this, and five and six blocking across here like this. So when the one blocks here, that's going to give us a one in that square, isn't it? Let's have a look at this five and six. Uh, so, huh? what have I done? I've made a mistake right at the beginning. Hold on a second. I've got five and six blocking down here like this. That means that these squares are <laughs> five and six. You see how it's going to be today, right? That means one blocking down here and one blocking down here will give me a one in that square. Totally unrehearsed, of course, as always. Uh, and I'm liable to make mistakes at the moment. Um, um, some stuff is going on here in Bangkok that I don't really want to talk about much, but... Um, life is not quite as joyous as it usually is for me um, but anyway hopefully we'll be back on track soon and we always do our best to enjoy life uh, so five and five and six in those squares we also know that seven blocking up here and blocking up here means that seven has to be here so we've got five six there we got seven there what do we know about the four we can place a four. Four blocking across here, four down here. That will be a four. And then the seven has got to be in that square there. And since we know that five and six are here, we're going to get this one, which is in fact two. Okay. We've got two blocking that square there. So in this column, that's a two. And up at the end there. We can finish with an 8. So I was going to look through digit by digit I was going to do that, but I stopped because I spotted something else instead. So I might have a quick look around again. Okay, four, two, three, uh, block up here. So that's two, three, and four in those squares. 
Uh, that doesn't give me anything down here, but it, at least I know that that is seven nine. So there's seven blocking across here. Here's our seven. There's our nine. And seven's going across here and across here and up here means that that's seven there. Seven, no, not going to get it. Sevens will be in those squares, won't they? Okay. Um, oh, I think I'm going to start looking again. Okay, so we got four and five in this column and this column that puts four and five up there. Does that mean anything? I don't know. Um, but anyway, it's four and five. We've got sixes blocking across here like this. So then that is going to be a six, isn't it? Uh, again, four, five here. So the remaining squares are one, three, nine. Uh, so one blocking across here that puts one into one of those squares and we've got one blocking up here So the one blocking back like that way. There we go. There's our one One down here one up there one across there. That'll give me a one in that square there Again four five here. What was I saying one? Three nine. Um, okay, I don't know about the rest. Oh, that's nice. Three just appeared as if by magic and opened up slot there.
Uh, I should be heading to pencil marks in just a mo. I'll just hold on one second just in case I spot anything else before I go forward. All right, let's, uh, <coughs> excuse me, let's <coughs> put in the pencil marks. Let's do some of these that I don't forget, first of all. Just want to make sure I don't <coughs> forget the ones that I've already seen. Um, uh, okay, so we've got ones in these squares and ones here and ones over there uh, the twos we have down here and we have in these squares here and we have there um, okay um, threes we have a pair of threes in these squares and these squares and we have three somewhere up there fours are across the middle and up there and there uh, a pair of fives down here and a pair of fives up there Okay, sevens must be in one of those squares there and those squares there and then eights we are limited to eights there for that block nines are here And uh, that's all that I noticed uh, in terms of pair work. So let's fill in the rest of the candidates to finish the game. As I said, you might not find uh, this method of solving to your satisfaction, but I'm not forcing it on you, am I? Uh, okay, so let's put in the threes and the nines here. And then let's go down here. Uh, what are we looking for? Six blocking down here like this. And nine. Um, can't see any restrictions on nine. I'll put them in there. What do we have down here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Blocking like this. So we have sixes in those squares. Seven. Oh, we've got sevens already. How about the eights? Blocking down and across. And nine blocking across like this, but that's all I know. And there we go. Let's see if I can find anything. Oh, yeah, look at that single. I was just putting my glasses on. I've taken them off again. That's going to be an eight. That's going to be an eight. That's going to be an eight. Let's get rid of some uh, eights that we don't need now. There and there. And we now know eights are up here here as well now nicely we have a pair of six nine here so we know that's going to be a five which means this is our five and this is our six six must be in this square here now 
and that will give us a 6 there and a 5 in this square. 5 blocking down here and across here and across here means that this is our 5, this is our 8, here's our 7, this is our 4 and a 3 is here and we can finish with a 9 there. It was all very nice wasn't it? Uh, now the 9 blocking up here puts 9 into one of those squares, so this can't be a 9, this must be a 9. And the missing digit here is a 7, I think. Okay, now we've also got 7 blocking this square, so this will be our 7. And this is a 3 to finish the row. This can't be a 3, can it? Okay, and this can't be a 3 either. What happened there? I thought I just deleted the three. I don't know what happened. Uh, did I hit? A t I think I hit a two, but I did. I oh, I hit a nine by mistake. My apologies. Although we don't need nines anyway, I got to get rid of the nines. <laughs> oh, strange! I don't know what happened there. This is in fact a two. I have no idea what's going on. I'm clicking left, right, and center here. This is a six. Um, this is going to be a 9 with a 6 in this square here. And uh, this will not be a 6. And neither will either of those, and nor will this be a 6. So we end up with a 1 9 pair there, is that right? Uh, this is the only position for a 2 now and this then is going to be a 1 and so this will be a 9 up here and this will be a 3 and a 1 will fit like so so a 1 down here and 9 in that square there right okay this can't be a 4 uh, what else is missing here we're looking for 2's in those squares aren't we and we're looking for nine in these squares okay right let's see what else is up for grabs um, Okay, so we've got five blocking this square and five blocking this square. So in this column, that's going to be a five. Then that will be a five, and this is a four. Four across here and four up there means this is our four. So we're left with a nine in that square. Two is here, four is there. Our two blocking up here gives us two in that square. We know this is an eight. Four blocks up here, so this is the four for the top row. This will be a three, and the missing number here is a nine. Uh, almost there. What's left to be done? Well, we've got to get rid of the fours, of course. Two, three. So we've got the two blocking there. There's our two. There's our three. So that's our hard level game for the New York Times over for the beginning of the working week, if you are working. Okay, see you around. Bye-bye.